Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Okay, good. Let's start the class having a conversation. Everybody. I'm all ears. I'm all ears. Uh huh. Say hello to your classmates, guys. Come on, it's Friday. Hello, <laughs> hello, hello, hello. Good evening. <laughs> Hi. Hello, teacher. How are you guys? I was talking on mute. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh huh. How are you guys? Someone said, I already speak English, so you have to speak English. Come on. How have you been up today? Yes, I know. Juan Gomez, how are you? Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you. Good. Okay. What is Jocelyn? I like to talk with Jocelyn. Uh, what do you want to talk? <laughs> How are you? I am very good, and you? Thank you. I'm fine. I'm fine too. What's your day today? Uh, my day was boring. <laughs> Why boring? It's Monday. Um, because um. Today, today was not, um, I don't know what to say. Se fue la luz. The light. There was an outage. The light went off. No. Okay. Lights went off. There was an outage. There was an outage. Oh. Blackout. Okay. Blackout. Yeah. A blackout is when the whole city got, oh, get, gets an outage. Oh, okay. mm -hmm. Good, good. Like, like last time, uh, last week. Yes, like, like, yes, exactly, like last week. Yes, as it happened last week, exactly. Yeah. In this case, when you, when you, we can use the light went out. Lights went out. Or oh, went off. Or went off. Went out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, remember, there are different ways of saying things in English. What about energy loss? Mm, that's when a device loses energy. Really? My team mentioned that. <laughs> when I report an issue. Yes. OK. Mm, OK. Now I just say outage. I had I experienced an outage. I do that every day too. You know, my lights go off. Yeah, so I say on the email that I have to report, my lights went off, or I had an outage from 7 a.m. to 7:05 a.m. Whatever the time it is. As in our case, yeah, in our case, they have we have to report the outages, or internet internet outage, light outage. It's very similar. Outage. Yeah. Right. Outage. How do you spell? Excellent. O T A G E. Just the way it sounds. Outage. Outage. That's right. Okay. 
Let's do this. I was just getting something ready for you as I promised. I can't believe I, I just found one option. So anyways, let's move it. Let's check your attendance really quick so we can get this going. Today is Monday, July 12th. Ada Susana Cáceres Mendoza. Welcome. Alexander de Jesús Sánchez Soto. Present. Excellent. Carla Ivania Cabrera Serrano. Present. Carlos Armando Duarte. Claudia Maricela Solano Crespín. Elvin Arcides Eguizabal Martínez. Present. Fátima Ifegenia López Ramos. Present. Sorry, present. Oh, sorry, present who's that? Claudia? Yes. Thank you. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Fernando Ernesto, no. Isela Liliana Miranda Espinosa. Present. Jared, Jose Antonio Cubillas Hernández. Carla Janet Amaya Herrera. Present. Thank you. Miguel Ángel Paz Landa Verde. Present. Thank you. Miriam Carolina Mozo Valdez. Present. Yeah. René Alfonso Madrid Escalante. Present. Rina Marisabel Álvarez de Chávez. Roberto Luis Umaña Orellana. Sabrina Mabel Latín Castro. Present. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Alan Christopher Abrego Grisuela. Here. Carolina Yvette Romero Avelino. Present. Johnny Vladimir Portillo Chávez. Present. José Alfredo Sandoval Sarabia. José Ángel Martínez Hernández. Juan Marcos Guzmán. Ok. Let's get this started. And we are 14 plus 3, 17. Ok, we're 17 right now in the class. Let's see how it goes. So today is Friday, guys. Today is your Friday. Although it's Monday, but today is Friday. I just counted 17 people and I have 19 already. Mm. That doesn't add up. How do you say eso no suma, eso no cuadra? It doesn't match. That doesn't match? Mm, no much yeah. That doesn't add up. Oh, I'm sorry. That doesn't add up. Okay, that doesn't add up. Repeat, that doesn't add up. That doesn't add up. That doesn't add up. Mm -hmm. add, up. add up. Okay. Add up, add up. Careful. Good job. Okay, let's start with our warming up activity. Today's session is most of all speaking, 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 okay? So let's do it. First, we have to start with the first question, okay? What is a promotional activity? We continue talking about the restaurant industry, okay? On unit one, on your book. So the first question, what is a promotional activity? How do you create a successful or how do you create successful promotional activities for your restaurant products? Okay. First question, what is a promotional activity? Can you describe it in your own words? Well, I believe this is the action when you when you right, when you take the action to create or do something new for your company in order to get a good uh, profit to get good profits okay what action for example in this case is um 
like marketing uh, in your social media, in your with your friends, with TV. Great. And You're thinking in the company, you know, overall. That's good. So you promote the company. Exactly. Mm -hmm. You promote the company. Okay, good job. Alexander, someone else? What is a promotional activity? I have 20 people here. Don't forget to please put your name, your full name. <laughs> Jocelyn, please fix your name. I will do it right now. Thank you. Rene Madrid too, if you can, please correct your name. If not, just let me know. And I'll correct it for you. Don't forget to turn on your camera as well, Carla, Miriam, and Sandra. Okay, come on guys. So what is a promotional activity? Uh huh. What is a promotional activity? Give your opinion. Intermediate one. No more, you know, out of the book answers. Out of the book answers. No. Your own judgment. Use your own judgment. And describe for me what is a promotional activity. I think, I believe. Señores, I think... algún... yeah. Go ahead. I think this uh, like a report for a uh, uh, get more customer a report. and try to to contact with them. To make products or activity. Mm -hmm. that. Yeah, that's right. That's it. That's right. Is to create other ways, just like Alexander was saying, to promote your product or the company, right? But what promotional activities do you know? I mean, what have you seen? What have you seen on the streets, on gas stations? at the supermarket, in restaurants, what promotional activities have you seen? Um, in my own words, uh, promotional activity is some, those kind of um, strategies that the company do for uh, develop the, the brand, some kind of, of I don't know, they, they want to sell, uh, improve the, the sales that they have of one brand, for example. Um, the activity that I see, in, for example, the samplers, samplers, the samplers, um, perfect. Mm -hmm. Models that they offer the, the product in the gas station or some kind of uh, uh, brochure. I, uh, Okay, brochure that they give to new potential, potential customers, clients. Very good. Excellent, Alan, great job. Remember to join the S, right? Like gas station, gas station. You join the, the S sound, okay? Great job. So yeah, that's it. It's just a promotional activity. You know, they hire some beautiful ladies, you know, or Muslims, Muslims, and they go like, hey, buy this product, right? They can do that. They can do um, offers, offers. And there are marketing offers, which is what Alexander was talking about. They can do marketing offers like on TV, social media. They can do that. So they can do marketing offers or on-site promotions, offers. Yeah. On-site promotions, okay. They sell products on discounted price. They offer products on discounted price. That's, that's part of them. And marketing offers is just promotions on TV, social media, correct. How do you create successful promotional activities 
for your restaurant products. We talked about this on Friday. How do you come up with a great idea for a product? There happens creating a need for the, the customers. Okay, that's a sell technique. That's right, that is a sell technique where you create the need on the consumer or the customer, right? You create the need where it, where it doesn't exist. Okay, so I want you to think for a minute because you will have to speak about this for five minutes with your classmates. I want you to think, what kind of customers do you have in a restaurant? What kind of customers do you have in a restaurant? Um, like, uh, what kind of is the uh, physical? Mm. Yeah. No, it's, it's... yeah, age. Or, oh, yeah. Age. Mm -hmm. uh, kid or children. Strato. Yeah, what's their stratus? Social stratus, you know, do you have kids, right? Children, as you said, children, elderly. What can you offer to an elderly person? What can you offer to children? That's the easiest. What can you offer to adults? Mm -hmm. That will be attractive and successful. So that's your point, Alexander? And yes, I think because you need to know uh, what kind of a customer you need to um, handle or manage your product to manage your product that's right that is correct okay so that's the first thought second thought someone else second thought mm -hmm. come on guys this is your class you have to speak Okay, so I'll talk. To create a successful promotional activity for your restaurant products, as, I, as Alexander was mentioning, as we were talking with Alexander, you have to think about what kind of customer you're going to attack, you're going to uh, approach, that's the word. What kind of customer you're going to approach? What, is, what will be your approach? Are you going to increase sales for children, for adults, or for elderly people? And what is your market? I mean, because every restaurant has different markets, right? For example, help me. If you go to Pizza Hut, um, we usually go in the evening, right? So in the evening, what kind of people do you see in any Pizza Hut restaurant? You see kids? Full family. Full family, right? Yes, the full family yes. is there. Parents and kids. Parents, kids, the whole family. The whole family is there. Okay. So that's their main market. Do you think Pizza Hut marketing strategies are oriented to whole families? Or is it just for business people? Because you, you, you see business people, right? With computers in some restaurants? And sometimes it depends on the, the time or for example, yeah. afternoon. The hour morning. of the day, the time of the day. Yeah. Exactly, good job. Uh -huh. It depends on the time of the day, right? But what's their strongest niche of market? What's their strongest niche of market? Oh, there's an email here. What is their strongest niche of market? Is it um, customer? No, no, no. Listen, children, adult, elderly, business people, women, men, youngest people, young people. Yeah. Hmm. Actually, children, because you are able to 
connect with the, the, the kid or the children, you are able to hack uh, the <laughs> I like family. That word. I like that word. <laughs> you hack the family, like in the supermarket, when you go to the register and you see all the candies, right? That's a selling strategy. That's a, a hacking sell strategy. And it's really mean because as a parent, you suffer, right? You suffer when your kid goes, Daddy, I want to. I, I want to go home. I want to chocolate. Come on, buy me a Kinder Sorpresa, right? I'm like, oh, damn it, right? It's really mean. That's cruel. Okay, so think about it. This is your options. These are your options, okay? Um, so how do you create a promotional activity that will be successful? It will be successful for your company, no matter what product you have right now. So think. What it, how do you create that activity? Who will it be oriented to? So two questions. What is a promotional activity? Number two, how do you create successful promotional activities for your restaurant products? Think, do you own a restaurant? Think, and please turn on your cameras at all times, okay? So I'll split you right now, just three, four participants, have a discussion in, around these two questions, okay? Let's go, guys, come on. Talk, talk, talk. Oh. <clears throat> hello, Fatima. Hello, Johnny. Hello. hello. How are you? Hi. Hi. Thank you. Thank How you. are you? <laughs> we started talking about it. Oh, what was the promotional well. activity? <laughs> I think. What okay. is the promotional activity? The homework. Okay. No. Okay. Um, when, for example, when companies establish um, strategies uh, to attract new customers, and my homework, uh, it is a Mexican restaurant. And, and about my the activities to attract new customers or incentive loyalty clients, um, like social networks, uh, because social networks, it is a trend. Uh, great content, gift cards, or, or uh, if my clients uh, purchase or buy an extra large combo with tacos, burritos, uh, get a free uh, dessert, for, for example. Um, in my, my niche market, niche market uh, can be young people or adults, business, business uh, people, and my and what about you sorry before you move on thank you great job carolina that's what i want to see just talk 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 i know you don't own a restaurant i know you maybe never worked in a restaurant but just have a conversation picture it i mean be creative good repeat purchase a purchase purchase, purchase. Okay. dessert uh, dessert Got to purchase yeah. dessert. Okay. Sure. Keep it going, keep going. In my, in my case, uh, for example, I have an idea. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, free pool for kids. Okay. Right? Mm -hmm. Under 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 ten years, one example, 
right? Okay. And for our for adults, uh, the money that they they pay for 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 two the entry mm -hmm. uh, evolution in 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 a drink for example for example that you would like to improve in your building uh building restaurant but exactly what is the tie or what is the different or what is exactly uh building or activity that you would like to create in your business for example one yeah. thing one thing that i that call my attention about juan is that he said money uh, let's correct that money 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 money, money. you got it one i would like to get yeah. a lot of money, money. okay <laughs> money 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 okay don't say money money Okay, money. Um, number two, for the entry, you were trying to say the cover. So what your idea is, what they pay for cover, what they pay for yeah. cover, you will give it in free food for the kids. That's the combination of a bar and a restaurant. <laughs> That's good, I like it. You know that in bars they cover, right? They, there's a cover. <laughs> No, come on, not, not bibs. Any bar, I think, has a cover, a minimum that you have to consume in the bar. Yeah. So, yeah, but restaurants, familiar restaurants don't have cover, but it's a good idea. I mean, if you're going to give free meal for the kids, wow. That's a good oh, idea. it's like what you can eat. <laughs> like, yeah. like, I'm sorry, Claudia? Oh, for example, when the promotion is all you can eat. No. Oh, yeah. All you can eat for kids. Mm -hmm. Awesome. But only vegetables. <laughs> <laughs> Silence. <laughs> That's funny. Okay. Good. Keep going. Great job. Keep talking. I'll be right back. Okay. okay. What about um, Alexander? Uh, in... Uh... In Facebook Marketplace, and uh, I don't know who the, the, the people are selling the product, but it's amazing that all around are um, trying to reach more people uh, in, in this kind of, of uh, platform, right? It's yeah, amazing. It's That's correct. That's correct. That. For example, yeah. the, the people pay yeah. a lot of money for uh, a get a, a space on the TV show, right? But just they uh, they put their things on Facebook and you reach a lot of people. Just the, the right thing that you have to do is uh, focus on who is the people you want to, to catch, right? Uh, that adversity, adversity is cheaper uh, in another uh, another strategy uh, publishing is I think uh, that that web, the website and and social uh, social media social media uh, I think is is cheaper than another uh, for uh, publish uh, population. Yeah, of course. It's a uh... the company use this strategy because uh, it, uh, the company say say uh, say money and um, and let me see and uh, uh, plan uh, a strategy and the marketing. Uh, in 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 social media is very cheaper. If you you don't uh, you don't be especially in marketing because uh, the people send you publication in, in the for example in the Facebook you sell uh, play market for it's a, it's a good example when you open the company can you can you 
uh, can you uh, publicate in this website? I think uh, is 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 very is, is a strategy very important right now for the for the company. Yeah, most of the time, uh, people uh, just need to get a little bit of creativity ideas, right? Yeah, that's correct. Take a right picture um, and try to, to think to uh, get the special um, as most, um, how can I say, uh, you need to attract the people, right? Okay, right. thank you. Awesome. Good job, guys. That's what I was expecting in the main group. Okay, just talk. Awesome. Okay, let's correct this. And actually, I will include this in, in a dynamic. We're going to do the difference before, between four and two. For get or to get? To get. To get get that's right two goes before the verb four yeah. before a noun good job and I, I knew you knew okay good job <laughs> who's the people they want to catch yes you can say that uh, who's the people they want to reach the people they want to reach for an american for an american hearing the word catch is bad for an american the word catch is synonym of scam. You know, when they call you okay. on the phone, hey, I need you to deposit $100 right now and you are the winner of $1,000. Bravo. Send me $100. That's a scam. Yeah, can you scam you... it, it mean similar? Yeah, to... to um, like a yeah. trip? A pimp? A what? A trip? A trip. A treat. You, oh, you, a treat. Yeah, that's a treat. A treat. Correct. Correct. Uh -huh. So they, they always ask you, hey, where's the catch? Where's the catch in this? Why are you? This happens to me every day, every day in a call center. Hey, where's the catch? Where's the catch? You send me a $100 gift card, a gift card. This is not possible. I mean, free money doesn't exist. Nothing's free. Okay, where's the catch? There's no catch. It's just remember, remember you hire television services, cable services. Oh, yes. So the promotion was you got the cable service, we send you a hundred dollars on a gift card. So you okay. can buy that's very common. It's very common. Four hundred, five hundred dollars. Can you um explain the difference between um catch and hack? Hack is what I'm working for right now. A hacker hacks an account. It goes, okay. It goes on an account nobody noticed. Nobody noticed, so he, he hacks into the place. But if scam or a cat, well, a scam is they it's lie similar. to you. No, they force you basically as well. They can force you to follow instructions on the phone and put money on this account, this bank account. A catch. Is a come on, see the cell phone? You can get it for you ten dollars. Okay, ten dollars. Okay, ten dollars. Thank you. And you try to turn on the cell phone. Doesn't happen. <laughs> Man, there there was a catch on that offer. There was a catch on that offer. Too bad. Yeah, it's very similar concepts. Okay, who's the people? Okay, social media. Elvin, repeat social media. Social media. Uh, let's go. So. So. Shall. Shall. Social. Uh, you're saying sh 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 uh, social. Social. Uh huh. You hear, guys? There's a sh. Is so social. So. Social. Hey, social. Tiene un ceseo antes de la s. Social. 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 Ay, uh -huh. Okay, usted igual en español le de pasar, ¿verdad? El... <laughs> Aire acá. Ajá, entonces tengo que hacer más en U la boca al hablar. Good. Social. Social. Good. Uh, Social. Media. There. Perfect. Social media. 
Totally. Social media. Ahora decíamos, cheaper than other publishing, cheaper than other media. Cheaper social than... dam. Social? So, I think so, social dam. Dam. An another concept? Another, another, um, another, uh, let me see, another. Um, no, another um, uh, mark marketing marketing strategy or another market marketing strategy. Okay, another marketing strategy. Marketing strategy. Okay, so yeah, but you were saying cheaper than other uh, marketing strategies. Let's say cheaper than other marketing niches. Um, strategy, strategic of marketing strategy of marketing or marketing strategy this qual this qualifies marketing strategy good job the, uh -huh, the people send your publication the people send your post they post. Uh -huh, okay. they share your post that's the hey the words las palabras que nos han traído los social media facebook twitter todas esas palabras ya está la real academia europea la, la real academia de lenguas la ha incluido Google, Google it. Google it. Yeah. yeah, Google it. Go ahead, Google it. It's new words, okay. Uh, creativity ideas, creative ideas. Alan, creative, creative ideas. ideas. You have to come up with creative ideas. Let's go. Good job, guys. Okay. Thank you very much. Señores, nos tenemos que matar el pánico escénico, pero ya, ya está grande, ya sos un adulto, no entiendo por qué, si te pregunto aquí, en frente de todos, que me contestes una pregunta, no querés hablar, nos vamos a los, a los grupos pequeños, y ahí sí, ¿quién te detiene? Súper bien, pero hagamos uno acá también, lo misma cosa, ¿eh? So, let's keep going, good job. So, I loved your ideas, great job for the ones I visited. I cannot split myself and go to every single classroom, but this actually works. So let's go. So the idea of this topic today is to provide suggestions, repeat suggestions. Let me hear you. Suggestions. Come on, guys. Suggestions. Suggestions. Okay, don't say suggestions. Uh -uh. Suggestions. 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 You hear, you hear that? You hear that? Shins. Shins. It's like when you say education. Okay, education. Education. Suggestion. Right, suggestion. Suggestions. And the problem, and the problem is that is that you have to pronounce this as suggestion, suggestion. 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 Okay, about the promotional activities of a product or service. So that's what we're gonna do. Provide suggestions about the promotional activities of a, of a product or service. So let's do it together. Let me show you first. The, um, Okay, let's go first with the reading, and then I'll get I'll let you practice with your classmates. So you have to do this. There we go. Okay, pay attention. Then I will select two of you to come to the front and do the best you can. Okay. So you say, Luigi is going to introduce a new kind of spicy pizza to the menu. We worked in an action plan, but we need to save costs and get customers to try the new product. Product. How about promotional activities at the restaurant 
you know, you could discount the green pepper sticks that never sell, then customers will get the green pepper sticks and you hook them up and you hook them up with the spicy pizza. I didn't think of that. Sounds like a good idea. Sounds like a good idea. You might want to have a promotional activity close to a big event, close to a big event, like a concert or a baseball game. You could offer a discount to the people who bought a ticket for the event. Oh my, I will call you later. Luigi is outside the restaurant giving free samples, but he isn't telling people the pizza is super spicy, super spicy. Again, the pizza is super spicy. Okay, any new words? Any new words in this reading? Mm -hmm. New words. Do you know what is spicy? Go ahead. What about sticks? Sticks. Uh, come again, Jocelyn, you're breaking up, I'm sorry. Uh, sorry, what is the meaning of stick? The meaning of sticks, okay. Do you know when you go to Pizza Hut and they give you these sticks where you can, you know, dip them, dip them into this beautiful, this delicious sauce, this tomato sauce, the sticks. Yeah. Uh, the sticks, like when you play the drums, you have two sticks. You have two sticks. Okay. I know there. <laughs> yes, but <laughs> didn't want to use Spanish, guys. Okay. There are many different kinds of sticks, like from a, bra from a branch, you know, of a tree. You can have a stick from a branch of a tree. Got it? Uh, Jocelyn, um, Wait, William, don't do that in the class, please. Mm -mm. Uh huh, Jocelyn. I have an idea that you mentioned that is the seed that the pizza have provided to you to to put into the pizza. So I mean, that is that is the one that they give you for a courtesy. Sometimes, yeah, there was a time when they were giving you free sticks in pizza hut and they make it from the sh from the uh pizza age from the age of the pizza um another example the guy that sells bread in your in your neighborhood the pan right some of these guys sell uh crunchy sticks crunchy bread sticks right uh, yeah yeah i i got Tell it me. Yeah, I got it. the idea. It's, it's thick. It's, uh... it's thick, actually. Look, look, look. This is thick. <laughs> this is a stick. This is a stick. This uh, part. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. That's a stick. Okay. Hey, fish sticks. In the United States, they love fish sticks. Fish sticks. And that's another thing. You put a fish on a stick. Uh, oh, they, yeah. they they put hot dogs in a stick. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Keep going. I love them. <laughs> really good. Okay. Spicy. What's spicy? Like a hot dog. Oh, come on! Don't use Spanish. Don't use Spanish. <laughs> Try to give me synonyms. Come on, guys. Good job. Hot sauce. Good, Carla. Like hot dog. Hot sauce. Very good. I think that's it. Uh, do you see any other green pepper sticks? Ew. The green pepper stinks. I like green pepper with cheese, you know, and then you put it on the flame. You like green pepper in the flames? 
or filled up with meat, green peppers filled up with meat and cheese. Yeah. 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 Good. Good. Like okay. So you, you know what's green pepper? Green peppers. Now, a green pepper in a stick. You. That's okay. That's why they don't sell. They don't sell the green pepper sticks. Customers will get the green pepper sticks and you hook them up. Hey, hook them up. Let's see. Yeah, yeah. Intermediates. What is the meaning of hook? Then up. up. The phrasal verb. That's the phrasal verb, right? Okay. So this is a separable, separable phrasal verb. Hook up. Hook them up. Do you understand that phrasal verb? To get customers. Hmm. Or similar. Is, similar? Yeah. To conduct them to, to you. <laughs> mm, yeah. Again, there's a catch, right, Alan? Catch, exactly. There's a catch. But you can use it in other contexts as well. Hey, I need a job, guys. I need a job. Miguel Angel works at the U.S. Embassy. Hey, Miguel Angel. Hook me up, Miguel Angel. Hook me up. Hook me up. Now. Make the con make the connection for me. I need a job. That's a hookup. That is with my boss. Perfect. Help you. Thank you. Awesome. Now that's a separable, separable phrasal verb. Hook them up. Hook me up. Let me hook you up. Hey, let me hook you up. I know the boss. Don't worry. Got it. Nepotism. Nepotism. Yes. <laughs> let's go to the. No, no, no. Let, let's not go politician. Okay. Let's go. I need two volunteers. Say me and your name. That's one. The one. What? Who? Me. Me too. Me Juan and me. Sanders. Me Sanders. Okay. One, two, three. Please turn on your camera, everybody. One, two, three. Action. Okay. Are we yellow start? You are going to start. <clears throat> okay. Okay. Luigi is going to introduce a new kid, a kind, sorry. Luigi is going to introduce a new kind of spicy pizza to the menu. We worked in action, in action plan, but we need to save costs and get customers to try the new product. All about promotional activities at the restaurant. You know, you put discount between pepper sticks that never sell. Then customers will get the green pepper sticks and you hook them up with the spicy pizza. I didn't think of that. Sounds like a good idea. You might want to have a promotional activity close to a big event like a concert or a baseball game. You could offer a discount to the people who bought a ticket for the event. Oh my, I will call you, call you later. Luigi is outside the restaurant giving free samples, but he isn't telling people the pizza is super spicy. spicy. There you go, great job. Hey, you are there. Uh, lo voy a decir en español porque es muy importante para mí que ustedes se den cuenta que ya llegaron, eh, ya llegaron al nivel intermedio. El, y les cuento así, honestamente, es raro ver un grupo como ustedes. Al menos, bueno, la mayoría, la mayoría los escucha hablar ya y me alegra mucho ver que ya llegaron. Ahora les decía, eso es un challenge para mí porque tengo que ver de qué manera les ayuda. ¿Cómo les ayudo yo entonces? Bueno, a pulir un poco más esa, el, el acento, no, a ir puliendo, el borrar el acento un poco. Es imposible. Si es solo si viajas a Estados Unidos, incluso yo tengo mis uh, errores aún en cuanto a acento cuando miro una palabra nueva, que ya es poco, pero igual puede ocurrir, ¿no? So, very good. Ahora, ¿qué nos falta? Unir sonidos. Linking sounds. Always pay attention to that. So, we worked in an action. And I missed that. Okay, me hizo falta a mí. We worked in an action. We worked in an action plan. We worked in an action plan. Repeat, Alex. 
I think. We work in an action plan. You got it. Simple. Okay. Paper sticks. Pepper sticks. Pepper sticks. One. Pepper sticks. Mm -hmm. We'll get the green pepper sticks. Pepper sticks. We'll get the pepper sticks. Good. Good idea. Sounds like a good idea. Good idea. Alex, sounds like a good idea. Sounds like a good idea. You got it. Next, uh, Juan. Who bought a ticket? Oh, both. Who bought a ticket? Okay, you could offer a discount to the people who bought a ticket, who bought a ticket for the event. Remember, that's another yes. thing. The article, the, you read it as the before a vowel, the event, the event. Okay. Who bought a ticket for the event? Go. Who bought a ticket for the event? The event. The event. Okay, good job. Let's do it. Please practice. Make sure you speak. Don't stay quiet. Repeat, 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 repeat. Teacher, ya le hicimos como cinco veces. Go ahead, keep going. Make sure you get it. Perfection is repetition. Don't believe me. Ask Alba Edison. Okay. Okay, let's go. Make sure you turn on your camera, please. Ay, Carolina. Microphone, caro. The microphone oh, silent. sorry. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, so. I didn't notice. Sorry. Okay, okay. I'm looking the conversation. Sorry. <laughs> no okay, page, page. I'm look, looking for. I'm looking. Ah, for. looking for. Yeah. Looking for conversation. Okay. Oh, which page it is? It is page third, no, 15. 15. 15. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. 15. Hi. Hi. Hi, teacher. Okay. Okay. I already received. Okay. Well. No se me Yeah. I cannot see. I will look in my phone. Don't worry. Okay. Let's go. Where you are, Carla? Okay. Try to turn on your camera if you can. Mm, yes, teacher. Sorry. It's okay. From the south. Um, I don't know what it is. I can't say. Really. Yeah, when, when you switch right the screen, I got it. Don't worry. I found it. Okay. Are you being, going to be Carla? And then be. Try to, to see the class. But today is different. I talk with my coach and I I explained that and this this was is different. I needed to listen in and I needed to practice my English because I needed to improve. Um okay, Carlita, now we practice the the conversation. Can you uh, share the no. pitch, please? Okay, I start. Uh, Luigi is going to okay. introduce. Um, do you can you uh, share the picture in WhatsApp, please? Because now yep. my. Thank you. Don't worry, I will got you. I'm just gonna paint here to cut it. You go to another academy. 
No, no. Uh, only explain that the last week I I I work and Friday and Thursday for this reason I cannot hear oh, the class. You, you couldn't you can be in the class. Okay, I got you. Okay, there you go. You have the image on the WhatsApp group. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Go ahead. Okay. okay. I start, Claudia, or you? Yes, I start. Okay, just let me check. Oh, can you see the picture well? Oh, sorry. <laughs> Look, and you are Carla or me? College. Uh, and and you had contact with children or old people? The people. The people oh. And remember, we are reading. We are reading the conversation, right? <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, because only. Okay. Um, okay. Recording in progress. Recording in progress. I, I hate that. You know, before there was no, um, how do you call that? There was no whispering. That's just, that's the way of, of that. That's the name of that thing, you know, is a whispering. Whispering. Yeah. There was no whispering I before. Remember, I remember the sounds like the Bluetooth speaker. The Bluetooth is ready to <laughs> No, but I'm saying Zoom didn't have that before. <laughs> it looks like something happened, you know, and people started complaining because the teachers or someone, you know, was jumping into their small rooms and they were like, oh my God, right? Recording. They were not told that the class was being recorded and uh, oops, so that's a problem. Now for legal terms, there's, there's the, no uh, way that you can hide it. <laughs> yeah, there's a way I can hide. I used to love it because I used to go in small groups with the camera off and they couldn't see me. I just listened. Hmm. Okay, we'll talk about it. Let's do the attendance one more time, really quick. Uh, Susana Cáceres Mendoza. Present teacher. Alexander de Jesús Sánchez Soto. Present. Thank you, Carla Ivania Cabrera Serrano. <laughs> Carlos Armando Duarte. Claudia Marisela Solano Crespín. Present teacher. Elvin Arcides Aguizabal Martinez. Aguizabal Martinez, present. Aguizabal, perdón, que no tiene la tilde, fíjese. Aguizabal. <laughs> okay, Fátima y Fegenia López Ramos. Present. Thank you. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Isela Liliana Miranda Espinosa. Present. José Antonio Cubillas Hernández. Carla Janet Amaya Herrera. Present. Miguel Ángel Paz Landaverde. Present. Miriam Carolina Mozo Valdés. Present. René Alfonso Madrid Escalante. Present. Reina Marisabel Álvarez de Chávez. Present. Roberto Luis Sumaña Orellana. Sabrina Mabel Latín Castro. Present. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Alan Christopher Abrego Brizuela. I'm here. Carolina Ivette Romero Avelino. Present. Johnny Vladimir Portillo Chávez. Present. José Alfredo Sandoval Sarabia. José Ángel Martínez Hernández. 
And Juan Marcos Guzmán. Present teacher. Bien, chicos. A ver, yo los traje de regreso porque, y no se vayan a sentir mal, pero noté algo que yo noto en las clases de con los bichos, donde solo hay bichos. Aquí todos estamos pollones, yo entiendo, pero es un comportamiento que no, no les quiero permitir a ustedes. Eh, el hecho de que se queden, o sea, callados y que no, si yo les digo, are we clear? Me digan, no me digan nadie, me diga nada. <ríe> o sea, les doy instrucciones y se quedan. Y después en el grupo, ¿qué dijo? <ríe> o sea, porque al final te estás perdiendo de aprender. Si tú te quedas callado y no sabes lo que estamos haciendo, es como, como decimos en Salvador, da, vas a dar vía, ¿no? No sé por qué inventaron eso, pero igual, dar vía, imagínate, uno, dos, los pongo en pareja con un propósito, y el propósito es presionarlos, ¿a qué? A que hables con tu compañero, por eso los traigo de regreso, de nuevo, los vuelvo a llevar a que hagamos la conversación, para que sientas la presión de que, de que estás en un salón de clase, ¿sí? en un salón de clase, no sé si ya habían tomado clases de inglés antes, pero se ponen frente a frente a los alumnos y se van cambiando. Esa es la dinámica. Entonces, ¿qué pasa si estás, como imagínate, estás frente a frente de alguien en, en vivo, no fuésemos virtuales, no estuvimos en virtuales? Qué feo que el que esté enfrente de vos no dijera nada. Yo solo puse la cara así. Uy, no. Y ahora acá en la clase virtual, la cámara apagada. O sea, entonces, ese es el punto, de encender la cámara, es de darle el sentido humano a esto, sentir que estás hablando con alguien, no con una pantalla en negro. Ok, número tres. Eh, vamos a practicar. No hablar de que si tú vives en, en Nopango, en Sayapango, tienes novio. Mm, yeah. <ríe> no, no se trata de eso, bichos. Digo bichos porque todos estamos pollones, de nuevo, ¿eh? Está bien, saca ese joven que va adentro, pero de una buena manera. Lo que hacen los bichos normalmente es como, ay, qué hueva. Yo sé, venís cansado, ¿saben? Este día se me ha ido volando. Y ahorita me acabo de dar cuenta, son las nueve, ya llevamos una hora de clase. ¿Ok? So, Monday. It's Monday. Y si yo siento como que viernes, no sé. ¿Ok? Quizás será la emoción de la inyección mañana. <risa> ok, no me, iba, no me la quería poner, pero ni modo. Es la vida. So. Vamos a hacer esto de nuevo. Hagámoslo bien, señores. Por favor, acordate que estás acá para practicar, aunque tú digas que ya te puedes esto, aunque tú creas que ya hablas perfectamente y aunque yo te diga que sí, hablas súper bien. Pensé en el prójimo. ¿Ok? So, let's do it. ¿Ok? Focused. Focused. We are 20 now. Good. Let's go. Same. Vamos a leer esa, esa conversación. Let's go. Evening. Hi. Hi. And Hi, Carla. Nice and, to you, meet you. And, and you, Mr. Sanders. No? <laughs> hey, that's right. Thank you for okay. Luigi is going to introduce a new king or a spicy pizza to the menu. We work in a, an action plan. But, the, but we need to sell costs and get customers to try the new product. Uh, how about promotional activity at the restaurant? You know, you could discount the green pepper stick that never sells. Then customer will get the green pepper stick and you hook them up with the spicy pizza. I didn't think up, think up. Some like a good, uh, yes. Idea, I, ¿cómo era? Idea. 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 Siempre me equivoco ahí. Don't so, worry. <laughs> idea. Ok. Right. You might Excellent. want to. Sorry. Sorry. Okay. 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 You might want to have a promotional activity close to a big event like a concert or a baseball game. You could offer a discount to the people who bought a ticket for the event. Oh my, I will care you later. You later. I Luigi outside the restaurant giving the free samples, but the, he isn't telling people the pizza is super spicy. Okay. 
Ok, good. Let's see. ¿Qué pasa cuando yo voy corriendo? Fíjense que yo salgo a veces con mi perro a correr, ¿verdad? Bien seguido. Bueno, ahorita no, porque se le han fregado las pezuñas, pero el punto es que noté al empezar a correr con él en la, en la reate de la Constitución que yo no podía, los primeros días, que no podía ir corriendo sin ver hacia abajo. Por lo menos fijarme bien a dónde vamos corriendo, porque me puedo ir en un hoyo o poner el pie sobre una piedra y me va a doler. Entonces, lo mismo ocurre cuando lees, no puedes correr a leer, sino que vas despacio, te puedes tropezar, o te comes una palabra o la pronuncias mal. So, focused on articulation more than speed. Repeat, worked. Worked. So, these two sounds, worked. Worked. Work. Worked. Excellent. Yeah, right. Yeah. So the base form of the verb is work. Work. Not T at the end, right? Not T at the end. In present, in present, you have work. But in past, you have two sounds. Work. 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 Okay. okay. Number two, you say but. But. You don't say but, you say but. Okay, but, 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 but. Mm -hmm. uh, next, the syllable stress is not product, it's product. Pro product. Ada, pro product. Product. Mm -hmm. The product. The product. Perfect. Later. Ada? Later. Perfect. You got it. Later. Okay. And that's what happens. You know, you can speak very well, Ada, but don't rush S slowly. Teacher, I, I didn't think of that. I didn't, didn't, didn't. I didn't. I didn't think of that. I didn't think of that. Okay. Got it. And lastly, Alan, the event. The event. No, the event, no, the event. The event. the event you got it do it again okay um uh, start with carlo right uh, sounds sounds mm. like a good idea i see i didn't think of that sound like a, like a good idea like mm -hmm. a good idea. sounds 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 mm -hmm. sounds like sounds. and we can and we can say we can say uh, event or event event but actually event. event the event the event, the event. Mm -hmm. is con event. concert the concert. concert 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 okay concert the other word discount um, discount 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 we worked in an action. We worked in an action plan. Mm -hmm. Product. Product. Many are saying product. Mm -mm. Product. 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 Later. What is that? Later. Later. Again. Is it? Is it? Later. Later. You got it. Later. Yeah. Your tongue goes back. I always, when I, when I was taking class um, five years ago, I always I always have you the issue with the sound. The final sounds. Yeah, and pronounce that word. I would say sound, sound, but it's sound. Sound, uh-huh, sounds. Yeah, listen to the sounds of silence, the sound of silence. The song, <laughs> so you can correct that. The sound of silence. Yep, discount. Okay, okay. good job. Let's go. do it again. Just one more time, okay? And we come back. Okay. okay. So Lu I'm going to start. Okay. Luigi is going to introduce a new kind. Just start. Okay. Luigi is going to introduce a new kind of space pizza to the menu. We were in action plan, but we need to serve cost a jet customer to the new product. 
What about promotional activities at the restaurant? You know, you could discount the green pepper sticks that never sell. Then customers will get the green pepper sticks and you hook them up with the spicy pizza. I didn't get that song like a good idea. You might want to have a promotional activity close to a big event like a concert or a baseball game. You could offer a discount to the people who bought a ticket for the event. Oh my, I will call you later, Luigi. This outset, the restaurant giving, for example, but the staying people, the pizza is super spicy. Okay, good job. Let's repeat uh, some words. Uh, like call, I will call you later. I will call you later. Fatima, I will call you later. I'll call you later. Luigi is outside. Luigi is outside. 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 Luigi is outside. Luigi is outside. It's outside. It's outside. Outside. Uh -huh. No se okay? Siempre. Come on, you can do it. Okay. Um, si vamos Carla, event, event, a big event, a big event, a big event, the event, the event, the event. Okay. I think it's time for us to come back. Let's go back. Okay. Bien, he tomado nota de algunas cosas que me gustaría hablar con ustedes rápido. ¿eh? Eh, no es regaño, chicos, es corregir nuestro comportamiento en la clase. Creo que no sé por qué estamos haciendo esto. Imagino que la mayoría ya estaban acá. Eh, al decir su nombre, al pasar lista, por favor, es exigencia de Insafor Paisi que digan present o presente. ¿verdad? Porque yo no los estoy viendo en ese momento. Yo estoy viendo el archivo donde llevo la, la asistencia de todos. Entonces, si alguien no dice presente, pues tú tienes asistencia y, y eso es lo que cuenta después. En ese momento, tener la cámara encendida, muy importante. Eh, por ejemplo, las dos veces que lo he pasado, ahorita, ahorita voy, eh, no, no ha contestado algunos porque no me sale la cuenta. O sea, aquí tengo 20 y allá me salían 18. O sea, sí, eh, ¿quién decía algo? Perdón. Eh, teacher, yo en la primera, eh, justo al momento que se estaba pasando lista, yo tengo dos, dos dispositivos audífonos conectados al teléfono uh -huh. y el otro se me encendió, se activó el que no tenía yo en... Entonces no lo ah, hacer. ok. Vaya, no hay problema, pero igual, yo, lo, yo incluso hago eso, después escaneo a quien me hace falta acá y lo pongo, pero ¿y si se me va? Eso es importante, ¿eh? Es igual, me pueden enviar un mensajito y me lo dijeron en el momento, pues muchas gracias. Bien, eh... Por eso es importante apresurarse. Oh, al regresar de los classrooms, de los pequeños grupos que acá hacemos, a ustedes les cae una notificación cuando yo les llamo. De él en un solo, digan, hey, ya, ya estuvo, terminemos, va. Nos llaman y regresamos, ¿ok? Inmediatamente, para no desperdiciar esos 30, 40 segundos valiosos que yo les tengo que estar esperando a que terminen de hablar allá y 
que les corte Eso, el sí. sistema. Uh -huh. <ríe> Vuelvan de un solo, porfa. Ok. Va. En ese sentido, al estar en grupos pequeños, les decía a un grupito ahí, no correr. Les ponía un ejemplo. Las primeras veces que yo salgo a correr con mi perro al, al arriate de la Constitución. Los primeros días, dos días, yo noté que si no me fijaba dónde iba corriendo, o me paraba en algo que no debía, una piedra o algún agujero, y no, yo me iba a caer. Entonces, lo mismo ocurre cuando lees. Si tú estás practicando lectura, si vas corriendo así, te aseguro, o te comes una palabra o no la decís bien, a pesar de que la sabes bien. ¿Sí me explico? Ojo. Entonces, enfocémonos más en la articulación que leer. Mencionar que no es necesario. Oh, no es necesario organizarse antes de empezar a hacer este ejercicio de la lectura. Porque usualmente hay uno o dos, hay dos caracteres o tres máximo, ¿eh? tres personajes en la lectura, o dos personajes en la lectura, entonces de un solo, dale, empezá, no esperes a que te digas, va, yo soy fulano y vos sos fulana, va, ahora cambiemos, tú vas a ser fulano y yo voy a ser fulano, y entonces tú vas a ser acá, o sea, dale de un solo, porque el punto es repetir, 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 cuantas veces sea posible, ok, and that's it, ¿por qué es importante eso? Eso queda grabado, después tú puedes volver a la, a la reunión, revisar la clase en YouTube cuando te mando el link, y en especial si crees que tienes problemas con articulación, te cuesta hablar, revise esa parte, ¿ok? Good. Let's continue. Any questions? <laughs> Perdón que hablé tan rápido, pero no quiero perder mucho tiempo en eso. Let's go. Let's continue. So, next part. Look at the conversation and complete the sentences. Well, we did this yesterday. This is a small practice. Think for a second. Let me see, Fatima. How does this go? Can you tell what is missing in this sentence? You discount the green pepper sticks that never sell. What are we missing here? Me, Sandra. Fatima? Mr. Sander. Mr. Sander. So it should say, you, Mr. Sanders? Okay, but what is missing here? What word is missing? Let's find the, the sentence here. Might have to, oh. might have to, oh my. Want to might want to have. Okay. You call, you call. Good, good, Fatima. Good, Fatima. You call. Come on, guys. It's okay. It's okay. Don't worry. <laughs> Don't worry. It's okay. Carla. Carla Janet. Next, number two. You might. You might. Yes. So we saw this yesterday. Models could or might. Okay. You could discount the green pepper sticks that never sell. Now think about it. Can Carla, do you think that Carla could discount the green pepper sticks? She could or she might? Might. Mm -hmm. So, could is among your possibilities. Está dentro de tus posibilidades. It's among your possibilities. You could do something. For example, I am fat. I could do something. I could do exercise. And that's it. It's up to me. It's up to me. Do you understand that word? Up to you. It's up to you. So it is up to. It's up to me if I want to get underweight. So it's under my control. So in this case, it's could. Because she's the owner of the restaurant, right? Carla is the owner. She could discount the green pepper sticks and that's it now you might want to have a promotional activity close to a big event you might want we said yesterday that's for a suggestion right both are for suggestions but this one you might want to have a promotional activity close to a big event like a concert or a baseball game okay let me ask you, if you live close to the Oscar Quiteño, no, wait, close to Flor Blanca Stadium, if you live close to Flor Blanca Stadium, 
wouldn't you have an, a business? Would you open a business? Or sell pastelito relleno or sell, I don't know, whatever, minutas, whatever, right? When there's an event, right? Yeah. It would be a great yeah. idea. So yes. you might want, right? You got it? You might want to. What about the last one? Ada, Azucena. You might or you could. You might can, teacher, sorry. <laughs> yes. Okay. Number three. You might offer a discount to the people no. who bought mm -hmm. or you could offer. You could offer. Why could and not might? Oh. Could. Mm -hmm. You could. Yes, it is good. Very good. But why? You could offer and discount to the people. Okay. Why do we use could and not might? Mm. No suggestion. It's not a suggestion because I'm the owner of the business. I can offer a discount if I want, if it is among my possibilities. Again, it's among my possibilities. Got it? Yes. Hope it is properly spelled. I believe so. Okay. It's among my possibilities to offer a discount to do something for that product. You got it? Now, in general terms, might is out of my control. It might rain. Can I say it could rain? No, right? No, because it might. It's, it's might. Uh, because it's might, right? It might rain. We did this exercise yesterday, so Let's go with something else. Before we do this about the product, uh, who's on a computer? Who is not? I'm sorry, on a computer. Who is not on a computer? Can you me, show, me. show me your emoji if you are not on a computer? You are not, not on a computer. Not in your computer. OK. One, two, three, with one, four, five, six. Okay. Now a question. Are you good at, are you good at jumping between screens with your cell phone? Are you good at jumping between screens on your cell phone? Yeah. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Good. If you can do that, then we're good. Okay. I have two screens. You have two screens? Perfect. Yeah. That's even better. Yeah. Let's try it. Let's give it a try, shall we? Shall we? Yeah. Yeah, yeah let's do it. <laughs> Just remember. <laughs> Happy, happy three friends. <laughs> you said it's lovely. <laughs> you got it. I remember. It's a little bit, a little bit psycho. <laughs> I know. Okay. This is Kahoot, guys. What is Kahoot? Oh, let's play with this. <laughs> it's an exam, but it's very funny. It's very fun. It's a lot of fun. Okay. So let's go classic. Now, how does it work? You have to go to Kahoot. That it. Okay, this website and introduce the game pin. Se lo voy a decir en español por si no alguien se quedó. Okay, here. Tienen que ir a esta website. Okay, meter un nickname que sería un apodo, pero prefiero que metan su nombre ahí, por favor. Y luego van a introducir ese código que les envié aquí en el chat de Zoom. Solo estoy esperando por ustedes. No sé si se perdieron, ¿no? Sí, 
Luis lo va a intentar entrar. Good, ahí tengo ya Elvin, very good. ¿Necesitan el, el mensaje en el WhatsApp? Teacher, please, yes. Ok, good. Talk. Déjenmelo saber. Come on. Let's go. The code. The code. Ahí está el código. Ok, there you go. It's on your WhatsApp too. Thank you. Great. Ok, si es por primera vez que vas a usar eso, que es muy probable, en una página, en una um, pantalla vas a tener esto que estás viendo y en otra pantalla te van a salir las respuestas. So, ojo, ahí es donde tenés que ser ágil, uh, start switching entre pantallas, estar cambiando entre pantallas, ok. Y si te estás diciendo, yo estoy muy viejo para esto, no, nunca es tarde, ¿eh? para ponerse al día con la, con, la, con la tecnología. Cuando tomé este curso de, de, de la OIT, sabes que tenía 15 salvadoreños, tenemos 15 salvadoreños ahí, eran italianos los que nos estaban dando la, la, la capacitación. De los 15, solo tres trabajábamos, duró seis meses la capacitación, 15 salvadoreños, solo tres trabajábamos todos los meses. Los demás, a saber qué se hicieron, y todos eran mayores de edad. Yo era el más joven. Imagínate, tengo casi 40 años. Oh, my God. So, it's never too late, guys. Okay, 14. 15. Great job. Okay, I think we're ready, right? 16. Juan Marcos, good. Okay. Bien, en esta pantalla van a salir las opciones, va a salir la pregunta junto con las opciones y después vas a tener que elegir el, corro, el color de la respuesta correcta, ¿ok? Color o figura de la respuesta correcta. So, vamos a hacer la primera pregunta de prueba. This is my, I'm sorry, may, might or could. May, might or could. So, quiz, first question. Take your umbrella as it may rain today may rain today or might rain today what happened was too short yeah it was just like five seconds right but i didn't touch the rule right because when you well when do you need to or when you have to Select the answer. Select the answer. Ok. En una de sus pantallas le va a salir, le decía, esto nada más, los colores, amarillo, rojo o azul. En mm -hmm. este caso, la respuesta correcta era el amarillo, ¿no? Solo tenías que seleccionar el color amarillo. Mm -hmm. May rain. Es de fill in the blanks. Estos ejercicios son de fill in the blanks. La palabra que falta es de pensar súper rápido. Take your umbrella as it may rain today it might rain estaba mal escrito might rain también may, I, may rain mm -hmm. but I have a question yeah. here because this only appeared in the colors but you need to select the color and the color show okay. you the, the message and you need to look for it ok, that was my point so, en un lado les decía van a tener esto que yo tengo acá si, que tienen ahorita, están viendo los colores aún no, no, ya no se puso en el. No. Okay. Sorry, uh, so ustedes tienen ahorita 0, 1, 1, right? Are you looking at my screen? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yes. So let's do this as an ex exercise to learn, okay? Second screen. And so I have the table of positions, only Ivania answered, and she answered right. Okay, look at the second one. En la segunda van a ver la pregunta por un par de segundos e inmediatamente los colores posibles, ¿ok? Ok. Ok, look. He is still at work. He might, ok, might come home late. 
solo son cinco segundos. Ahorita solo tenés los colores y en la otra tenés las opciones. Solo son ah. cinco segundos. Yeah, I know. I know. Okay, so he may come. Good. Ya le agarraron varios ahorita. He may come. May come será el azul. He might came. Amarillo, no tenía sentido. Let's do the next one. So you can get it, okay? Solo son siete. I am guessing. <laughs> You're just guessing. <laughs> okay. La siguiente, solo hagamos la de ejercicio. Muévanse entre pantallas en su celular. En una página les va a salir la pregunta y en la otra página los tres colores posibles, ¿ok? That's okay. the point. Look, look. Look at those clouds. It might rain in a minute. It may will rain. It may rain. It might rain. What? Ok. Todos dijeron It may rain, pero may está mal escrito. May. Mm. It may rain. Ok. Six. Very good. Ok. Ivania is on fire. Ok. Let's go with the next one. It's just seven. I might go to the party, but I'm not sure yet. I might go. I might go. I might went. Might go. Very good. Oh, I see. Le agarraron. Very good. Okay. And the next one. Ivan is on fire still. Okay. He might be American judging by his accent. He could be American. He could be American. He might be. He might couldn't be American. What? So you got could. Good. He could be American judging by his accent. Good. And I think we're missing only one. Vani is going to be the winner. Sabrina is almost there. With luck, tomorrow could be a sunny day. Will be a sunny day. Could will be a sunny day. What? Okay. Seven said could, and that's the answer. That is correct. Okay. I think we're missing one. Yes, last one. You could be right, you might be right, you might be right. Only two options, might or might. Yes, very good, you might be right. Samal escrito might, with an S at the end. You might be right, but I'm going to check anyway. You got it. And, uh -huh. Sabrina, third place. Caroline, second place. And number one is for <laughs> Ivania. Okay. Good job. Wanna try something else? Did you like it? It's kind of. Yes, I like it. Yes, I like it. This is a good exercise. I, I really, really like it. Yeah, no sé quién se inventó esas aplicaciones, pero wow, mis respetos. Wow. Tú puedes crear la tuya, de hecho. La semana, no, yo les, discul les pido disculpas porque no me fijé en el tiempo que tenía cada pregunta. Usualmente elijo las que tienen 20 segundos. So, this one was just 10 seconds for each um, option. Okay, now let's try something else, okay? Because we need to practice with could or might. So let's join together into one board. I love this. Let's join together into one board. Okay, this one, I'm going to let this one. Allow me just a minute. Take your time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
There we go. It's a mute picture. Yeah, I know. It's just that there are some sounds here that I don't want you to hear. <laughs> don't worry. You know what? I just can load this thing. Um, one the second. There we go. Okay, I'm going to share this one with you. Okay, and that's the only thing we're gonna do. There's a link on WhatsApp. You can open it. I'm gonna put it here on the Zoom as well. And this is a participative whiteboard. It's a participative whiteboard. There you go. I think we've chosen this one. Come again. Anything stuck? Um, no, this should be Google. It's Google. If you're on a Google device, Google. you don't need to install it. I don't know why I need this option. You can install it if you want. It's Google. Okay. Okay, what are we doing? I, I'm not sharing the screen. Okay, good. So look, here you go. You can start, if you're already in, you can do this. Look, you can grab a sticky note. It's safe and that's it. You might grab a sticky note if you want. And start giving me examples with might or could. Go ahead. You can use your finger to grab a sticky note. Here, you see the sticky note? Esta es una pizarra colaborativa. Tú puedes participar con tus dedos. Aquí todos estamos conectados. Es una pizarra en la que todos podemos escribir. So go ahead. I need examples with could or might. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yes, you can draw too. También puedes dibujar. <laughs> Ahorita necesito ejemplos con might and could en un sticky note. En una... Sí, si se dice en español también, creo, ¿no? Sticky note... Um... Okay, está complicado. Hi, guys. I'm just waiting for your examples. Oh, some of you are in the other page. You could park the car better. Okay, si se fijaron, hay dos páginas. Tres, de hecho, no sé quién creó otra página ya, pero está bien. It's okay. You might have a different nationality. You might have. Mm. So in ese caso es muy, es probable, pero, mm. okay. You could draw in something, you could draw. Miren, también puedo corregirle a alguien más. Draw something, you could draw something. You could park the car better. You could help me with English. Could you help me? Yeah, totally. You covered someone. You could get a new job. You could do it different as we're doing right now. Yeah. <laughs> you could do it different. 
always think of different options to do things. You could bring the dinner. The dinner, you could bring dinner. You could bring dinner. Okay. She might return later to the class. She might return later. Oh, return. Hold on. Return. Return. There you go. She might return later. Return later to the class. Someone created another two pages. Someone created other two pages and it's okay. Okay. They could sell another product. This is a simple whiteboard. There's another another one called Miro, Miro.com, and that's crazier than this one. Hay otra que se llama Miro.com. Este tiene muchísimas más herramientas y te puedes hacer zoom en una sola página. Es como un mapa. Um, so we're brainstorming, you know, when you want to brainstorm, you can do that in Teams. It's amazing. It's really good. Okay, they could sell another product. Yeah. You could do it different, okay. You got it. I think you have no questions, right? This could, might, is very easy. Easy to do. She might travel around the world, totally. Why not? Yeah, you could help me study, totally. She could take the children with her to Houston, yeah. You might change color to your Nota de Siva, sticky note. <laughs> <laughs> you might change color to your sticky note. Okay. Mm. You might be back by noon. Totally, guys. You, you're awesome. You're awesome. You speak a lot, and that's really good. I think there are no more notes on one, two, just in two and three. Okay. Good job. Let's go back to the book, okay? Uh, yeah, let's go back to the book. I'm sorry. We have to continue with the topics. <laughs> Excellent. And just put Jamboard on Google and you'll get it, okay? These are free uh, tools you can use, Kahoot. And the other one was, um, I mentioned it, I forgot the name, Miro, Miro.com, M-I-R-O.com. If you do presentations at work, you want to surprise your boss, <laughs> it's gonna go crazy with that, okay? Next activity match these words to describe promotional strategies to their meaning. Publicity stunts, bundling, love that word, public relations, loyalty offerings, and sampling. I think you have an idea of sampling, loyalty offerings, public relations, but bundling and Publicity stunts. Mm. So let's do this together in groups. Match A with the appropriate description. Publicity stunts. Is it personalized incentives, the promotion of product by distributing samples of it, offering several products, several, I'm sorry, several products for sales as one combined product? So find the right definition, okay, for each statement, for each. Um, words okay let's do it together shall we okay okay let's do it we're still on the same page 16 this exercise is in is six in the the platform. Don't worry, I'll send it to you right now. What's up? Hello. Hello, Miriam. Okay. What is the page? Page 16. 16. 16. Okay. 
Okay. Letter eight. Is the letter B? Letter. Personalized incentives. Personalized incentives. Oh, um, no. <laughs> Publicity stunts is letter D or no? Huh? <laughs> okay. <clears throat> I'm confused. Publicity is some um, personalist incentives is different okay. D. Um, um, Literal Share screen? No. No. Uh, uh, hey, the update events decide to attract the public attention. Literal B, yeah. E. Little B. Little B. Uh, C. <clears throat> Literal C. Offering several products for sale as one convenient product is literal A. Publicity stunt. Something. Okay, let's see. No. Public stunts. No. Mine product. Mm -hmm. No. D. What is it? D. D. Sí, va, y, el, y el otro es para como de lo que sí se sí puede hacer uno, va. Uh -huh. Pero ese dice maíz often use with one o like to add polinices. No vamos va porque hay que irse dice. No. Para. Not yet. ¿Y yo para dónde? Not yet. Just wait. Are you are you done? Are you done? Yes, we done. Oh, good. Okay. Yeah. Give me, give me just one minute. Okay. We're we're almost done. 
Okay. Thank you. Favorable the public image. Image. Uh, the professional name, my names of a favorable public image yeah. is the letter C. No. Uh -huh. Yeah, the yeah. letter C, public relations. Letter D, loyalty offerings. Is el personal, personalized. Yeah, the letter D is personalized incentives. Incentives, uh -huh. incentives. And E. Letter E is e, the, the promotion of a product. Yeah, the promotion of a product by distrib distrib distributing 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 samples of it. Uh -huh, distributing samples of it. Distributing. Okay. Okay. Um, okay. Finish. Okay. Publicity stunts. A, plan, a planned event. Events. Maybe as a part. Amo. Entonces le es es líder. Events. 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 Me va a teacher. Yo digo oh, events. You can do it. Events. 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 What is, what is the correct? Event. Events. 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 Ah, yo yo también decía events. Everybody. Ajá. Everybody says events. Okay, event. Event. Favorable, así es. Favorable. O no. Favorable. Favorable. Yeah, you will find weird words in this stage. Favorable. Favorable public image. Okay, let's go back. You got it. Okay. That's something written down here. Okay. Let's see how long it takes. 30 seconds. 28 seconds. 25 seconds. 23 seconds. I know what I'm going to be doing. Okay, Claudia, Jocelyn, Miriam, Carolina, René Alfonso, Reina, Jocelyn. Okay. <laughs> Jocelyn, Miriam, okay, René, okay, let me see. So this will be like when we used to go to break. Okay, the last one coming back to the classroom will have a punishment. Castigo para el último que regrese el recreo, okay? In this case of the classrooms. Let's see, I know you know. Jocelyn, what is, the, what is the past participle of catch? Past participle of catch. Catch, I guess it is a same one because it's irregular. Mm, you got it, it's irregular, but it's not catched. Catch. Caught. Mm. Hot. Mm. Hot. It sounds like the past of teach, Ren Alfonso. Oh. Past of teach. Oh. Yes. Ren Alfonso. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> What's the past of teach? The past participle of teach. Mm. I don't know. Do you know, Alexander, you said? It's taught. Taught. Very oh. good. So Jocelyn is similar to taught. Mm, catch. I guess there is catch. Okay, this at the end. Okay. Uh -huh. No, 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 it's just, it is irregular. It, just like teach. So you say teach, taught, catch, okay, caught. Oh, okay. You see, very similar, taught, taught. Yeah. Cut, cut. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> okay, guys. So let's see. Let's see the answers for this section really quick. 
So publicity stunts. Where's the definition? One, two, three, four, or five? Mm -hmm. Yes, actually. Three. The three? offering several. Three. three offering several products. Okay. That's the one convenient. For a sell as a one. Yeah. Offering several products for sale as one combined product. Yeah. Did someone got something different? Should be a loyalty offerings. Publicity yeah. stunts. You are asking for the first one, personal personalized incentive. Oh, what is it? I'm sorry. Yeah, publicity stunts, a plan event designed to attract the public's attention. Okay. So this is made public. Okay. Yeah. Bundling. What's bundling? A planned event designed to strike the public's attention. No. What is, what is what? What is letter B? What is bundling? Bundling? Um, bundling. Yeah. Let me give you the answer. Would be um, a planned event designed to attract the public's attention. Offering several products for sale as one combined product. Let me give you an example. In the United States, Direct TV sells cable TV plus internet plus cell phone and landline for services bundled into one. Just like in El Salvador, you get TV and cable, internet Sorry. and phone. Mm -hmm. yeah, sorry, I, I, I know what is the meaning, but in this case, when I try to respond in the in the question given mm -hmm. on the web page, mm -hmm. the answer is wrong, actually. And, and you know, <laughs> I have to try another one in this case, offering similar products. On the platform. Exactly. Okay, I'll check that. I'll check that. Let's see, personalized incentives. Loyalty okay. offer. Loyalty <laughs> offerings, right? <laughs> Loyalty. Because they're loyal. Okay. Uh, what are we missing here? We're missing the promotion of a product by distributing samples of it. Sampling. Yes. Sampling. 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 Okay, that will be letter E. Yeah. And by default, yeah. A, B, we're missing C here. Public relations, the professional maintenance of a favorable public image. Yes. This makes sense. It makes a lot of sense. Take a screenshot, study this, and you will find sense on it. Okay, let me actually take a screenshot and send it to you so you can study it uh, for later. Okay, class is over. Hey, today I need... Dun, 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 dun. Jose Antonio Cubillas Hernandez. Is he here? Jose Antonio? No, Jose Antonio. Okay. Can I have Jose Antonio? That's Jose Antonio Cubillas. Wait, twice. Rina Marisabel? Yes. She, what, you were with me yesterday on Friday, right? Miguel Angel Paz? No, Miguel yeah. Angel? Yeah? yeah, okay. Can you stay 10 minutes? No, no, no. Just Google teacher. <laughs> Okay, not a I'm problem. Thursday. Okay, Ada. Oh, no, but can you stay again? Yeah, no, no, no. Thursday to me. Okay, Ada Susena, ya estuvo. Okay, yeah. Sandra Elizabeth. No, Sandra Elizabeth. Okay, Alexander de Jesus. Present. Okay, can you stay 10 minutes? Sure. Okay, not a problem. Let's do it then because uh, the person today is not present and I cannot be alone talking to myself. I am the last of the list. <laughs> I know, I know, don't worry. Okay, Ada Susana Cáceres Mendoza. Present. Good night. You can Good leave, night. you may leave. Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Present. Good night. Carla Ivania Cabrera Serrano. Present. Good night. Good night. 
Carlos Armando Duarte. Claudia Marisela Solano Crespin. Present teacher. Good thank you. Elvin Ar Arcides Aguizabal Martínez. Present. Fátima Ifegenia López Ramos. Present. Thank you. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Isela Liliana Miranda Espinosa. Present. José Antonio Cubías Hernández. Carla Yanet Amaya Herrera. Present. Good night. Good night. Miguel Ángel Paz Landa Verde. Present. Good night, Miriam Carolina Mozo Valdés. Present. Night, René Alonso Madrid Good Escalante. Present. Good night. Good night, Rina Marisabel Álvarez de Chávez. Present. Good night, Roberto Luis Umaña Orellana. Sabrina Mabel Latín Castro. Present. Good night. Bye, teacher. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Thank you. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Good night. Good night. Alan Christopher Abrego Brizuela. Present. Carolina Ivette Romero Avelino. Present. Good night. Good night. Johnny Vladimir Portillo Chávez. Present. Good night. Good night. José Alfredo Sandoval Sarabia, José Ángel Martínez Hernández, Juan Marcos Guzmán. Present and good night. Good night, sir. Take care. Bye, Rina. Okay, good, Alexander. Hey, you do speak English. Fluently. That's good. So we just have about seven minutes uh, the person who was meant to be here didn't assist the class. So tell me, how may I help you? Yeah, <laughs> sorry. And, and sometimes happens when I am working as well. <laughs> and yeah, I believe that your class is super good. Um, but in my case, I would like to practice more my fluency. Fluency? Um, yeah, and vocabulary as well. And vocabulary. What are you doing to improve those? Actually, uh, only um, uh, sometimes I try to, to learn in English or, uh, sorry, uh, to read in English. And sometimes I... I'm in trying to get some um, idioms or phrases, not phrases, but only phrases. Mm -hmm. And you know, let me tell you a secret. Can you hear me well? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, I've never used a huge amount of idioms or phrasal verbs, and if I do, I don't even notice. But in reality. Is not about. It isn't. Is not about the vocabulary, but how you express yourself and how you come up with the idea of something. So, two things to correct the the way you speak. You just have to talk to yourself. At this point, the way you speak is good. Well, I will, what I will recommend you is do the, the just a minute, just a minute technique, the jam technique. Never heard? Yeah. Yeah. yeah? You heard about yeah. the jam technique, just a minute. You know, you go in front of the mirror, you talk about any topic. So let's try it if you want. Um, can you talk to me about rocks? Rocks. Yeah. Wait, let's do a quick exercise here so you get my point. Because okay. the, the point at right now is that you can challenge yourself and you can do this at home as well. Okay. Let me just change the, uh, okay. There we go. Just preparing something, hold on. Okay. Okay. There you go. So let me get a stopwatch really quick. This is not it. I said a stopwatch and I need actually a timer, not a stopwatch. 
Okay, there you go. So let me set the timer for one minute. Let's test your fluency. Fluency is just time, you know, versus how many sentences you can make. An intermediate student is supposed to make up to 10, 12 sentences in 45 seconds based on some studies. So whenever you're ready, ready? Talk to yeah. me about rocks. I'm giving you the chance. You already thought about rocks. One, two, three, action. Okay, well, actually, I believe that when we are talking about rocks, we have to learn our, about the weight or the, or the form about different kind of rocks, right? Because you can use it even in your daily basis or, you know, because you can build some things or you can create your own buildings about it. And sometimes it's difficult because when you throw it uh, or when you threw it to at someone else is actually is is bad because he's you can damage to others and but sometimes you can use it in the good way for example you can draw on the rocks and you can create um, different kinds of drawing or okay good thank you <laughs> oh landscape <laughs> Ooh, okay no don't pay attention to my writing right now um but in, in yes in some way so let's analyze this great fluency but that's the point it's not about how fast i can talk it's about how good i articulate and avoid making mistakes. If you notice, I don't, I totally avoid in the class speaking fast. A teacher is not there to brag. You know, you know what is brag? No, brag. to, to no. show off. I show. Yeah. You know, to, when, what is to show off? In Spanish or in English? Ah, Spanish, tell me. Como presumir. Uh -huh, right, to brag, no, to show off like the rabbit or sorry, the hare and the turtle, right? The rabbit and the turtle. Remember the, his, the story? Yeah. The rabbit and the turtle, the same thing. So I'm not here to brag in the class. If I wanted to brag, I will just spend the whole class. That's not the point, you see? So let's see that if we are talking about, uh, I think that if we are talking about, what was wrong here? No, that was okay. I was okay. I think that if we are talking about, oh, well, future, well, if we are going to talk about, if we're going to talk about, sounds better, right? This is point number one. Always criticize yourself. At this level, Alexander, you are ready to start criticizing yourself. So what, judge, what you just did, are you understanding everything? Yeah, yeah. Okay. What you just did do it but like this i mean like this record yourself record yourself talk about one thing record yourself and then play it and listen to yourself okay and start judging hey you know what i could have said could have said that if we are going to talk about rocks Man, I say Kai, Kai of rocks. What was wrong here? Pronunciation. That kind of rocks. Kind of. Repeat, kind of rocks. Kind of rocks. There are different kinds of rocks. Different kinds. Yeah, different kinds of rocks. Okay, you have rocks on rivers. You have rocks in uh, the sand, you know, the oceans of the beach, whatever. Okay. You can use it. Okay. Now, am I talking about one rock or many rocks? <laughs> you criticize yourself. You can use them. You can use them for here, preposition. And then I will go, man, I have to exercise this. I have to do exercises with prepositions for two. You can use them for buildings, mm, for building about it, building with them. 
maybe yeah you can use them for building with them you know buildings houses whatever you want to build whatever you want to build you can build with rocks when you hear it you went like wait is it throw or through throw through throw through <laughs> it's uh, it happens it's <laughs> yeah. okay listen it's okay for you to make these mistakes because then you go and i said throw through i didn't know what is it when you throw you have to set your mind listen set your mind are you speaking in past or present like that in an interview this is a brain um this is um Man, I forgot the word. It's a question to break your mind, you know, really quick. Tell me about yourself. Oh, my name is Alexander. I'm 26 years old and I live with my parents. Okay, talk to me about rocks. Oh, uh, rocks. You have 30 seconds. Oh, crap. You see? And they go like, oh, it's my difficult God. To, it's difficult to make it up. To make it up, yeah. Creativity, very important. When you throw, uh, you may, what we saw today, you may damage others. Damage, do you damage people or do you hurt people? Mm, yeah, you hurt. <laughs> you hurt others. To others or do you hurt others? You may hurt or, others. Or okay, others. different. And again, chaos. Uh, chaos, that's the way it sounds to me. Different kinds of or kind of and so on. So, este punto. Se llama autocorrección. Eh, y gracias a Dios yo tuve eso cuando estaba pequeño. No sé ni cómo. Quizás lo traía eh, por de fábrica, pero tenía un diccionario y tenía un cuadertito chiquito y andaba buscando las palabras. En español las escribía, no creas que en inglés, pero no andaba el diccionario como todo el tiempo. Y cuando llegaba a la casa las traducía. Llegó un punto cuando tenía como 15 años que empecé a hablar yo solo, conmigo mismo. Parecía loco. Y se reían a veces mi, mi familia. ¿Qué te pasa que estás hablando vos solo? I don't know, I don't say solo así. Claro, el, el acento me lo borré ya con los años de call centers. Los primeros cuatro años lo borré porque trabajé en una aerolínea. Entonces, apóyame, ahí sí, a la fuerza, papá, el agua pato, pasé dos meses sin salario cuando los call centers empezaban a venir en El Salvador. Y fue increíble, te doy una bendición completa. Claro, pasar de 174 a 50 mil dólares es un gran cambio de vida. Pero, eh, entonces, ese es el punto. Noté eso. Ya hoy en el 2016 entendí que cuál, cuál fue mi metodología para aprender y lo estoy haciendo, lo voy desarrollando poco a poco aún. Entender esto, autocorregite. O sea, ¿qué hace una persona cuando se queda huérfana? ¿Cómo aprende todo lo que tiene que aprender? Crece en la calle. Uh -huh. De la misma manera, la misma necesidad es entender que tiene que aprender a leer, a hablar. Pues lo mismo. Ahorita, a este punto, Alexander, criticate. Ocupa tu tiempo libre, que te digan que estás loco, habla con vos, vos mismo en español. Cree que andas en, en una conferencia, empezaba a hablar de X tema. Aunque no te lo sepas de todo. Prefiero la autoconfianza antes que la preparación completa. Ya. Una universidad no te va a enseñar esto, tienes que aprenderlo solo, a soltarte. Enseñar eso en una entrevista de trabajo y va adentro. ¿Got it? Got it. Ok. Good. okay. Cualquier cosa, ya estoy escribiendo, ok? Good night. Okay. Good night. Bye.